Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to Hunter Call of the Wild. Guys, 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 guys. I just got this game a few days ago, and uh, I don't know where it's been my entire life, because this game is freaking amazing. I love it. Um, I do have a few strong opinions about certain things, um, but we won't just hop into those. Uh, what we are going to do is we are going to hop into one of these new maps that I bought. I think Leighton Lake is the one you... Yeah, it's like default. It's kind of sucky poop. Um, so I bought a couple of these others. Parque Fernando. Par Parque Fernando. Uh, Yukon Valley. I didn't buy that one. Silver Ridge Peaks. This is the one we're going to be trying today. I have already just hopped into this map to just take a look around. Literally spent like, like, maybe not even 10 minutes on this map. Animals freaking everywhere. It was insane. Like, see, look, look, you can see the animals right there. There's freaking bison and bears everywhere. There's freaking turkeys and mule deer and white-tailed deer and all sorts of shiznuts. What's over there? Ooh, it's a mule deer. Me, me. White tails are better. And the one who says otherwise is a fart. They taste better. They don't spend their entire day eating freaking sagebrush. Oh, look at there. What do we have up there? Some antelope and a bison. Dude. Do you... That branch, you could literally break that off and use that as a freaking prison ship. Holy crap. Anyways, uh, the inventory we are using today is I did buy an additional gun bundle pack because the gun you start off with is just, it's farts, let's be real. Um, so I bought the modern rifle pack i think is what it was so you uh got this 308 um it came with several varieties of these with different styles so we're rocking a 308 uh we got 223 uh a 22 lr we can pop rabbits and turkeys no problem with that and then this guy is like close-up protection this thing the ammo it shoots is these freaking chunkers expansion a hundred percent holy cannoli poops like crazy yeah you have to be like sniffing the animal's butt basically to use this but this that gun packs a freaking punch so without further ado let's find our victim there i don't even know where to turn there's so many animals on this freaking map it is psycho There's like buffalo everywhere. I mean, I freaking go to I I go to Yellowstone sometimes and don't see this much freaking buffalo. Who's that? What are you? Oh, turkey, turkey, dude! Turkeys are so weird, such weird creatures. They're so dumb too. We used to have turkeys, and they. We literally were brought them home and they were like eating their own feces. They were super tame. We could like. How did that? Tracks are my go to source for insight into animals in the reserve. Space, Going down, clown. Mood. Yeah. You can learn a lot we had some of those white turkeys. Spotted anything. Oh, shut up. I wasn't paying attention to you, dude. Tell my own story. We had those massive giant white turkeys. Oh my gosh, those things were freaking tanks with legs. They would just follow us around the yard. We'd put dog leashes on them. They were kind of adorable, but then they got fat and ugly and then we gave them to a neighbor because we didn't have this space and he just kept them for a couple more months and used them for a massive, massive freaking 
Thanksgiving feast with all of this extent down. Ooh, silver. We're just going to accept it. We don't care. It's not gold. Or diamond. Another silver. Oh, also, if you guys are thinking about getting this game, or if you already have it, you already know. Freaking dog. You need the dog. Dogs are amazing, and they just make your life better. How? Get your butt up here. Roscoe. Over here. Dude. Find the other one I shot. Oh my gosh, there's a bug flying in my freaking face. It's driving me bonkers. Go away! I'm trying to shoot stuff. Holy... They don't even care! I just killed and shot like several turkeys and they just don't care. I love it. Hunting is amazing. I mean, there are some aspects of this that are somewhat realistic, but honestly, sometimes, especially on that initial map that you get with the game, I think actual hunting is easier than trying to hunt on that map. It's literally, like, hard. Everything just runs away from you, like, forever away. I'm trying to do, like, missions and kill, like, freaking coyotes, and the coyotes are just pff, freaking stupid. But yeah, we got ourselves some turkeys. Yummy, yummy, in my tummy. Lab that added up on a piece of bread. Also, when I initially spawned in um, to give it a rough checkout, there was an albino freaking bison. That thing looked majestic looking. I was tempted to just take it out, but I was like, uh, no, I'll back out and have y'all join me. What? I thought that was a deer staring at me. I know we got like missions to do, but half the time I don't care. Reach the lookout tower. Oh, yeah, the survival. Yeah, you need water. Water's more important than food. Luckily, we stole some from our little shack over there. What is this little thing they're talking about? Lookout tower? Boop, boop, boop. Uh, for those of you guys who haven't played this game, uh, these little insignias right here, these lookout points, if you go to those, they reveal a big section of the map. So it's really nice to also buy the ATV bundle. And then when you spawn in, you can uh, go to one of your house icons. And there'll be a little shed and you can access your ATV. And then you can drive around to all the watchtower points and unlock so much more of your map faster versus just wandering around on foot. Oh, 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 oh. The albino bison. Come on, Roscoe. Forget the tower. We got a bag of bison. Another one. Shut up, pronghorn. Shut up, you weenie. Oh, go away. Go jump over a fence, you fart. I used to live in Wyoming, and uh, freaking pronghorns were freaking everywhere. Freaking ridiculous. I'll constantly see them getting hit by freaking semis. And they're kind of dumb, too. It's like, they can jump so freaking high, but they won't jump a freaking fence. To go get food on the other side because they're lazy. Like if there's not a crawl space underneath, like a a, a a a spot where they can slip under, they'll just stay on the other side of the fence and literally just starve to death. They're really dumb creatures. I 
I have hunted them before with my uh, my grandpa. We went out and we had a decoy, just a plywood cutout of one, just painted, and we just walked up on one, and I was holding it. My grandpa was behind me with a bow. That thing just charged us, and my grandpa just popped up from behind it and popped it. Oh, these things. Let's mask our scent. I do use the scent mask or desensitizer. I don't know what his official name is, but I use that spray, and it's quite helpful in this game. In real life, I don't ever bother with that garbage. I'm a simple hunter. I don't need all these... I'm not the one with, like, a backpack full of 30 different, like, hunting knives. My grandpa and go, we got a little fanny pack. It's literally got... Like a foldable uh, bone saw that we just got for, like, 10 bucks at Walmart. And then a hook. Hook knife, hook razor knife, and then a pocket knife, and that's basic. We can unzip animals and like so fast. I want that. <clears throat> what what do they call it when you like the albino creatures? There's one that starts with an M, like melanistic. Melan Mel I'm not even. I'm gonna butcher it if I try and say it. Oh, we got ourselves a big fresh dookie poop. Let's lick it. Oh, that thing has texture. Look at that. We'll have to look at it outside. Oh my gosh. Ew. Grody. Oh. <gasps> I was about to say, well, the white buffalo has, uh... Gone to live another day, but not. What are you doing? Did I incapacitate his legs? It's like not even running. Oh, I did not want to get trampled by that thing. Do I know something interesting or weird, I guess? Not really interesting, because you probably don't care. But one of my old bosses, we used to call him the White Buffalo. That was his nickname. He was some big... Some big, thick... White dude who... Was the creator of our company. He was super... Nice. Oh, we have to save this thing. I know it's a bronze. People are going to be like, Ugh! Yeah, it, it would have been higher if I wouldn't have pumped it full of three shots. Look at this thing. That thing is freaking beautiful. Dang. Except, where are we off to now? Ew. We load the gun, the gun, 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 gun. An unloaded weapon. Does you no good, people. What is that? Oh, that shadow looks like a big, chunky monkey. Ooh. These little things are usually little uh, areas where you can pop up little tree stands or hunting huts. Hunting blinds. They usually cost like 1700 or 2100 usually. This one's gonna be... Oh, this is a nice one. The other ones in the other map are just farts. This one's good. Oh, such a nice view. That is juicy. That is juicy, juicy, juicy. And look at all this freak. A little side pocket window? 
Whoa! I like it a lot. Is that rock? Is that something we gotta... Yeah, they'll have like little notes. They're just like basically piles of rocks that you just go... What is that over there? I see you. I see you. My boy. How do I get out of this thing? Oh. I go out the little hidey hole. Let's go see what this note has to say and maybe cap this pronghorn. Can I do that with the T23? It's a four. The pronghorn is the fastest land mammal in North America. They're not as sensitive to noise as some of the other animals in the reserve, but they trust their eyes, so stay down and hidden to prevent them from bolting. Yes, I know. You dingus, I need to get some other calls. Uh, I was gonna check the inventory and see. Two twenty three. Extension. The the description on this thing. T23 high-velocity bullet that combines the superior aerodynamics of a Spitzer-type bullet with the rapid expansion of a hollow point. Yet the expansion's freaking three. Let's be real. Like, <laughs> yeah, right. I might just shoot it with the 308 just to be safe. Go over here for a nicer shot. Oh, the grass is too high. I can't see. Ugh. Money! Go down! Please go down. I don't want to chase you the freaking kingdom to come. Look at that guy go! Those things are fast as crap! Teepee rings are found all over the Great Plains and Southern Rocky Mountains. The indigenous people of the region used the stones at the circular encampments to ensure that their teepees stayed level with the... Okay. Stayed level with the ground. They are often located near promising hunting sites or travel routes. Obviously, we all know they traveled to in in line with the migrations of the animals so they could freaking feed their people. It's not rocket science, it's rocket science people. Let's go and get ourselves a little frog horn. Woohoo! Is this that turd? No, that's a turkey tracks. Uh, go, go, go. Roscoe, track him. Get him. Go nibble his toes. Nah. <laughs> Ah, oh, poo. Well, the, the tracking begins. Guys, I've literally, this is, I think, my third day having this game, and I've literally, like, played it for a few hours every single day since I got it. Which is just the two other days, and then now. But. Oh my gosh. You get sucked in, and then you'll be like, wow, I've been uh, playing this game for several hours. Dang! Freaking antelope! Okay, now it's 50 to 75%. Get him, Roscoe! 
There's... I thought I saw something in that corner. Occasionally, if your dog... What is... Oh my gosh. Dude, catch your breath. You oh. monkey butt. Oh. There's some oh. turkeys I can pop. Oh. What? Did you not see that bullet literally go through the turkey and hit the dirt right behind oh. it? Hey, Roscoe, I'm capping a turkey. Give me a minute. Seriously? Seriously, you saw me literally cap your friend while you were right next to him. You dingus. Well, I'll take it. Like I said, turkeys are dumb. What is that? Oh. Just another oh. turkey, finally. Uno momento, rasco. Gotta yoink me up some more turkey meat. Slap that on a freaking sandwich with some lettuce and tomatoes and oregano. Ooh, and bacon. You need bacon too. I didn't even pay attention to the stats of that one. I just don't care. Is that our freaking. That's our freaking antelope, dude. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. Ugh. Ugh. You made me run halfway across the mountain to get you. Mm, you turd. You said silver. Okay, let's accept that. Seven hundred bucks. Okay, whatever. We'll take it. Anyway, guys, if you haven't checked out this game, I highly recommend it. It's pretty fun. Some things are completely realistic, as they are in actual hunting, in my opinion. Um, But it's still a great game. And also check out this map. I think it's Silver Peaks or something like that. Way more animals than the late and far from Nugan. So, uh... I will catch you guys on the next one, and I'll oh, come here, you. Come here, you. Have a treat. You tracked it. You're a good boy. Bye-bye now.